And on the home front tonight, a new real estate report paints another grim picture of property values for home sellers in Bakersfield. But it may be good news for buyers. The latest report from appraiser Gary Crabtree shows single-family home prices continue to slide. 17's Kiyoshi Tomono explains what this means for your home and our county. Appraiser Gary Crabtree has some sobering news about homes. The median price of the home has dropped 20 percent since its peak in June of 2006. That's a $10,000 drop in the Bakersfield area last month alone. Uh, that's good news for home buyers. Uh, very bad news for home sellers. The glut of foreclosed homes is driving all home prices lower, but brown lawns aside, the foreclosures have also driven up demand by buyers looking for a bargain. 46% of all of the uh, properties, uh, single family properties in Bakersfield that sold were uh, actually foreclosure yeah, properties. Right now, that includes right. bank owned properties like this one in Brighton Estates. Yeah, it's kind of died off a little bit. Yeah. Real estate agent John Vaughn walked us through it today. You've got to be the lowest priced one in the in the area in order to sell it. This four bedroom, 3,000 square foot house might have sold for more than $600,000 two years ago. Today, it's listed at just under 406,000. Is it a hard thing to do to tell somebody to lower their asking price? It's not really that difficult. I mean, because you're actually doing them a better service, telling them this is you need to bring your price down rather than just having a market or just having a home sit on the market because it's not doing anybody any good. The falling prices won't sink county services too much. The assessor says most houses were purchased before the boom. And if anything, most are undervalued in terms of taxes. At any rate, it's all continuing evidence of a cooling market in which all home sellers now have to compete. I remember back in 03 and 04, that a lot of people were saying, I just can't afford a home. Well, these days, it's so much more realistic for them. In Southwest Bakersfield, Kiyoshi Tomono, 17 News.